Blum. Well, in case you missed it, let me step out of the way here because, wow, that says all the words I could ever say. I'm speechless looking at yesterday's sunset. This was uh, shared from the Nebraska men's basketball team, I think around game time or just before the game time as the sun was kind of setting last night. Wow, it looks like the sky was on fire. But wait, there's more. I uh, got another picture from Cameron Barker as he shared this uh, yesterday. It's just a lot of purples and blues even on the fringes as you step a little bit farther away. This still Pinnacle Bank Arena, but my gosh, no place like Nebraska, am I right? Another one from Jerry uh, Rotschiffer. Excuse me for that name, but the sky just looked like it was on fire. A couple of hay bales down there too. My gosh, I can't get enough of this. Went to bed pretty late because uh, how great that sunset was last night. Unfortunately, that's all the pictures I'm going to share with you for now. There are more on our website that you can go catch, uh, go check out, and we appreciate everyone uh, sending in those pictures because my goodness, they're great, and we don't always have the best eyes from our cameras. But even the cameras look pretty good last night. This is a live look from uh, South 21st and L Street. It's dark out there. We'll see how many more. More uh, November sunsets we can really uh, keep adding to the list because it seems like lately, I don't know if you remember last Friday, there was another good one and there's been several uh, with some cloud cover kind of coming into play. Should have that again tonight, but temperatures right now, uh, we're starting off Tuesday morning a little bit cooler with middle 30s at the Lincoln Airport. Also seeing that in Wahoo, 45 degrees in Grand Island, 42 in Kearney. But overall today expecting because we're dropping off a little bit more this morning, temperatures to not be as warm as yesterday, but upper 60s for uh, early November. Can't complain about that with light winds out of the southeast. That'll be a little bit of a warm front that kind of works its way through the area to give us those southeast winds eventually. A little bit more cloud cover even than what we're seeing right now expected through the morning hours, but uh, some high thin clouds out there right now as you look across the state. As we go throughout the afternoon, though, temperatures going to be warming up pretty nicely again, like we were saying, 54 by 10 o'clock, a little bit more cloud cover through the 9, 10 o'clock hour, and then uh, partly cloudy skies through the rest of the day with uh, highs in the upper 60s. I would say uh, don't get used to this, but it looks like a lot of this kind of weather is going to stick around, even though we'll get cooler by the end of this week. Middle 50s is actually where we should be at this time of the year so not too bad through Thursday and Friday that uh, Veterans Day home Husker game looks great with temperatures in the middle 50s and uh, light winds through the weekend, but plenty more sunshine to even uh, kind of carry us over into next week as we look through the middle of November. You see no precipitation chances still. It's going to be quiet. Not a great chance for rain anytime soon. I am going to get used to this weather, Jessica, and hey. then I'm going to blame you when it gets cold again. You know, it will eventually get there, but I'm really happy that we can hold off for now.